In this video, I will show you two methods for highlighting text in CapCut for PC. First, import the picture containing the text you wish to highlight. Then add a default text and align it above the picture. Change the text color. Choose a color that stands out. There are various ways in which this can be achieved. My own method is easy to use, works reliably, and has a low impact on your system resources. Start character map from the window start menu. Character map is a standard Windows application is comes with Windows. No installation is required. Scroll down then double click on the solid rectangle character. Then select and copy it to the Windows clipboard. Select the text item and paste the copied character. Now scale it so that it covers the whole sentence. Deactivate the uniform scale checkbox to enable the width and height to be scaled individually. Change the width and height, then move it to cover the sentence you want to highlight. Later, in a further step, we make this transparent to allow the text to shine through. Before that, let's take care of the animation. CapCut fortunately comes with a handy built-in preset animation, so we don't have to tediously animate via keyframes. Increase the duration of the wipe right animation. That looks quite nice. Copy the text and repeat the steps to highlight the second and third sentence. If the text to be highlighted is shorter, adjust the scale width and the animation duration. Then adjust the length of the text. Let's preview. That is good enough for a training course. Last but not least, select all animated text items and create a compound clip. Change the blend mode of the compound clip to multiply. So that was the first simple method of highlighting text in CapCut. If you want to change anything under the compound clip first, I will now show you another method that is also very easy to achieve, but perhaps looks a little better. This time I'm going to create the text highlight myself in Microsoft Paint. Select a color and use the Paint Bucket tool. Then save the file and import it back into CapCut. Adjust the size of the image you have just added so that it covers the sentence you want to highlight. Place it in the right position. Finally, Change the blend mode to make it transparent. This time, I'm going to use a mask to create the animation. Select the horizontal mask from the video tab. Rotate the mask. It's a bit hard to see. I hope you are doing well and can follow this tutorial. If you now move the mask, you will get a nice effect. Also note the feather slider. You can use it to adjust the gradient at the end. Move the playhead at the beginning of the highlight picture. Add a keyframe for the position of the mask. Move the playback head in time and also adjust the mask X position. Then add another keyframe. Repeat the steps a few times. By the way, as you probably know, CapCut is smart. When moving the playhead and changing the position of the mask, you don't need to press each time the button to create the keyframe. I'm going to change the feather settings a bit. That looks good to me. Let's have a look from the beginning. So, that's it. Those were my two methods for creating a text highlighting effect in CapCut for PC. Which method do you prefer? Leave a comment below.